so it may be a little quieter. Okay. So we're anticipating the uh, start here any time now, as we do have. It's fringe on the line. It is fringe on the line, and it looks like CIA has brought their buggy out and got it out in time. And they're off. So this is the first exhibition heat. We just have Fringe and CIA. Fringe with the uh, black buggy and bright green wheels, and then CIA with the uh, blue buggy uh, with uh, kind of the blackish visor in front. It looks like a pretty good hill time, and it's Mirage. The CIA buggy is Mirage. So uh, it looks like they're getting ready to do their first hill one, hill two handoff. Pretty smooth handoff for uh, both teams. And uh, coming around the corner into the first free roll of the day. So we're coming around the backside, and these are uh, <laughs> exhibition heats and uh, so uh, these are more liabilities than anything else but it gives the team some opportunities to uh, uh, to get some of their alumni out pushing who may have put in thousands of hours years before and the CIA and buggies lost their handle by the way ah actually uh, the interesting thing about CIA's buggy isn't necessarily losing the handle it's uh, they actually have a retractable push handle and the idea is that it uh, helps increase the aerodynamics of the buggy uh, first team to do it a long time ago, or one of the first teams to do it a long time ago. And we're already around to the stop sign. Fringe is way out in the lead. I, I think the uh, CIA buggy may not necessarily be winning this heat, but uh, in the exhibition heats, if we can get through safely, everybody's a winner. As uh, makes it past the uh, first flagger by the statue in front of Phipps Conservatory, and uh, past the second flagger, and I, I don't see the CIA buggy. Ah, there it is in the background. It's about 20 seconds back, and they're coming into the chute. Uh, now, for those of you who aren't, aren't aware, and shoot is probably the best place to be hanging out during race day, because it's where you're most likely to see things spin out of control and uh, crash. And it looks like the CIA buggy has made it into the uh, chute okay, and is coming through okay in the first turn. And then they're just picking it up at the backside, and it looks like uh, finally the Hill 3 pusher for uh, Fringe picked up their buggy and is starting to race up the hill. Uh, exhibiting certain signs of uh, partying last night, so they may not be quite as quick, but uh, they're handing <laughs> off to their Hill 4 pusher. And uh, right in the background, it uh, looks like CIA picked up, picked up their buggy okay as it made it cleanly through the chute. And uh, we're going to head all the way up to the finish line, and uh, so be sure to cheer on these guys. It's exhibit heats, but uh, it's just as hard pushing it up Hill 3, 4, and 5 on the backside of campus. And uh, I know the crowd isn't quite as out yet because uh, the main races won't start for, uh, the rerolls don't start till 8.30. And those are kind of the first races that really count. But lots of opportunities to learn about buggy, see the teams, see your old friendly alumni actually pushing it and see some of the mechanics get on the course who may not have had a chance to do so all year. And uh, looks like we're coming up on the finish line. They aren't running the official times, but in exhibition heats, if we can get the buggies well, through safely, everyone's a winner. We've got the times here on uh, CMU TV. We've got a, uh, the stopwatch here in the top left-hand corner. So we're going up on 245 here as we see the fringe team making their way towards the finish line. And I don't think there's an expectation that these, uh, these heats are necessarily going to be sub, uh, sub three minute times unless uh, the teams are pretty strong. And that's going to be about 257. Four fringe. Ah, good run. And I don't quite see CIA yet, but I think those of you watching on uh, CMU TV can probably see the buggy coming up the backside yeah. near the alumni house. Yeah, they're on the back stretch there. And I should uh, tell you that uh, sweepstakes is coverage. I'm calling from the uh, Toyota lead truck, uh, which has been uh, kindly donated uh, to sweepstakes. And it looks like CIA is making it across the finish line. 3:23. Yep. Yeah. A good time. And yeah, their handles back up as as you see.